um, is the next morning and we are going to make some breakfast sausage. This is our mixture that we pre-mix up for our breakfast sausage. This is like a two ounce little container. I got these off of Amazon. These are real glass bottoms with the bamboo top and it keeps them nice and fresh with this seal right here. I will link these down below. These are awesome. These are the only like two ounce containers I found that were not plastic. So I really like these because we like the glass. And we are going to use the 99% lean ground turkey from Genio. Okay, we don't use any oil in here at all. So we just chop this up a little bit here. And then we used to mix it all up, but I found that it tastes just exactly the same. Taking the mixture here and just sprinkling over the top and just keep, keep, um, chopping it up until it's all mixed in there really, really well. So I've been chopping for about three minutes and it's pretty well mixed in now and it's pretty small. And I use this chopper from Pampered Chef. I have a link down below with my niece's information. Okay, so far I've got some, making up some breakfast with my breakfast sausage. I've got some frozen peppers here that we cut up ourselves throw in a big gallon baggie and throw it in the freezer. Same thing with onions, and I just use the last of my onions up. I've got some of these potatoes here, which I got yesterday. Just chop those up really fine. I've got some cheese here. I didn't add any cheese yet, and I've got some cilantro here. That's all going in my breakfast, along with eggs, of course. I've got my sausage over here in a four cup bowl. This is one pound of turkey. Fits great in this one um, four cup Pyrex container. And then this is my potatoes, how small I have those chopped up with the onions and the peppers. So I'm just going to put a cover on that and leave it, leave those potatoes soften up quite a bit. This cheese blend is one point for one half ounce. We're going to use one half ounce each for our breakfast. I showed this several times on my channel, but we have cilantro here and I rinse it off really well stick it on some paper towel and I roll it up a couple times with paper towel and it's going to be a little wet and then rip it off and I do wet the bottom of this just the very tips of it and I throw it right back in the bag that I got it from and that keeps it fresh for at least a few days longer wrapping it in this paper towel and wetting the ends a little bit throwing it back in there and don't like closing it off tightly leave the open leave the front this part open a little bit it just seems to last so much longer as you can see I just wet the bottom I don't bring it bring it out or anything I just kind of tuck it in there and then just put it right back in the bag it came in when I use the cilantro I just take the whole bag out of the fridge kind of pull down the paper towel a little bit and just chop off the top of how much I think I'm going to need and then I'll just put this right back in the fridge okay so our potatoes were done I just threw two of these crushed garlic they come in little um, squares like that and I just punched in two of those put in a half a cup of the sausage and I threw in three eggs in the center I don't like screwing around too much and mixing it up in a bowl and all that and wasting all that dishes so I just throw them right in the middle and I just scramble them up put some salt and pepper on all of this and the cheese is going in here in a little bit we're putting a half of or one full ounce of cheese at the very end with the cilantro at the very end you take it all off of the heat. Okay, I removed this all from the heat and I've got one ounce of cheese weighed out here. I'm just going to sprinkle this over the top of it all. Sprinkle in our cilantro over the top. We like cilantro a lot and it's really good with breakfast food. And then I'm going to give this a good stir and this is going to be a whole two smart points. So two smart points per serving. This big pan makes two servings. So it's a lot of breakfast. I'll let you know if it's good. This is the first time I ever tried this type of mixture with all of these same ingredients. I always kind of switch it up a little bit. This is our hash with eggs. You saw everything else that went into it and it is very good. I really like it. And that cilantro, perfect addition if you don't like cilantro leave it out but i say the cilantro is a perfect addition to this 
So as usual, I forgot something in here. I forgot the potatoes, which are two because we only had two and a half ounces each. So two points for that. So a total of four points for this. Still not bad for a huge hash breakfast. This is a big bowl. So it's a huge hash breakfast and you could split it in three and get it for two points that way. This is four points, not two. So as Corey was eating this, he mentioned that the cilantro kind of overpowered the breakfast sausage. So I will keep his cilantro out next time because he prefers it without the cilantro. And I just love cilantro on everything. So I would keep mine in and add it afterward. So lunch today is partially, this is half of our lunch. It is a zucchini that was fried and some coconut spray from Trader Joe's, which is this stuff right here. And we're having three Mexi rolls for eight points with this. So this is our dinner tonight. We're having leftover hamburger, stir fry sort of thing, five points. And then I'm having a coffee for one. We're having a water issue, I'm telling you guys. You go on a budget and everything decides to go wrong. So this is the hot water. So full open. The cold works. The cold works fine. The hot, no, not so much. So I had to haul all the dishes downstairs to wash them. I am so thankful that I have a sink downstairs to be able to do that. I'm waiting for the washer to go out, guys. I am, it's on its last leg too. It's got to hold out till we can remodel the kitchen. That's all I have to say. <laughs> or I'll be washing clothes by hand in the sink. Hey guys, I'm just making some overnight oats real quick for tomorrow for breakfast. It is late. Just wanted to close up the vlog here after the last two days of vlogging, pretty much, and then showing you some recipes. We are heading to bed right now, and I will see you guys in the morning. Bye. And so